hello guys welcome back to my channel and uh, let me give the disclaimer for this lab this lab is quite complicated so i request you to uh, please watch the video carefully and in this lab you have to do all the all the steps you can't skip any steps okay first you have to log in with your credentials like on open the google cloud from here and log in over here okay then scroll down a little bit and click on this lab and uh, click here click on this link, uh, link and open in incognito as well as i open already okay now change the project from here okay click on rename now just scroll down copy this just replace with this and then scroll down a little bit now from here okay let me show you what i click uh, once you're done with this uh, click here in project uh, in the and now click on show the app this script or this again go to editor and you will be able to see your uh, app script or this okay uh, before going to that uh, file just save this file now copy okay just copy the app uh, app script or this here this and uh, come over here and replace or continue this okay now what we have to do as i told you we have to log in over here in a uh, cloud console just search for api and services open this in new tab you can open in the same tab as well click on the fourth option and from here copy the app name first choose internal then app name from here choose the query body from here and with this scroll down at last developer contact information save save and continue and again save and continue for task two you don't need to do anything for summary you can click and just click on back to dashboard okay we have done with this now click on deploy okay now click on deploy now please watch carefully now now click on new deployment now it will ask for the please select please select the okay this is new okay i we haven't saved the file yet that's why first save the file now click on the new deployment it will load it will ask for the choose the project click on here scroll down a little bit click on change project and first click on here this here link from here you will get the project number this is a project number copy this come over here and paste over here Let's change now click on again new deployment this time it ask for the description like right right now click on just deploy now the main thing copy this uh, deployment id you need this id in next task so i am just copy this and open my one notepad and i'm copying over here okay now what we have to do uh, this is just for uh, uh, what we can say double check cross verification as we can say that come over here here click on library and search for that google chat api you will get this for chat api and now click on the manage it will load and then click on configuration now we have to add it add this details over here like this here from here to here now choose receive one v one message then choose app script project and paste our uh, deployment id which we copy in last step like this scroll down a little bit uh, and now we don't need that deployment id we have done with that uh, id just copy your uh, student id and paste over here make sure you uh, choose the specific people and group now click on save it will be saved in some time 
now now please look carefully okay if i just click on check my progress button it won't give them a score okay now open this in incognito again and uh, we don't need this dashboard so we can close this tab it will take few seconds now it's done now click on okay get start cross click on plus icon now find apps and if if you if you follow the lab lab instruction you won't get just copy the attendant bot from here and paste over here you will get the attendant bot and then click on chat okay it will take time and it's done now just type hello and hit enter button okay it will not responding like that and if i just click on the check my progress button wait for a second it will take time okay that is likewise it's done now come over here code.js copy this enter editor click on editor button go to code.js enter hit enter again hit enter okay now we are done with this make sure you save the file save now what we have to do we have to deploy new version so just click on deploy manage deployment and click on this pencil icon and from here choose new version now click on just deploy we have got to go and if we just check the process it might take as as in last one okay it's done now just you can type anything like reset or anything anything just yeah you said reset like this just wait for a second please follow the life it's it's just taking some time for uh, yeah as i just told you now for task 4 first copy this come over here and paste the command here again hit enter multiple times now copy second command paste over here hit enter multiple times copy this hit enter multiple times now you are done again we have to oh, no look, look look save the project and just for cross verification we just need to add uh, first of all we have to add like api click on services and search for the api google uh, gmail api okay and now click on add okay then we have to save the uh, we have to update the version click on manage deployment click on setting from here choose new version and click on deploy and meanwhile once it's done go to your configuration go to your library and go to your gmail api by default it's enabled if not just click on the enable button and right now it's enabled for me so no need to do anything as it's told in the lab page also now we have to test the lab okay what we have to copy like this let me just zoom it we have to copy what it is gone just let me zoom out yeah this 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 huh we have to just copy i am sick like this okay from here copy this and come to your chatbot and paste over here it will take a time just a wait let me zoom out yeah it will take some time okay so no need to worry again you can't just oh like see as i told you now click on configure choose your project id from here choose allow now you can be close the map okay now set the uh, uh, set vacation in gmail click on that now block out the day yeah you have done with both the steps now just check the process Congratulations guys
if you have any doubt please let me know thanks for watching have a good day